Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome back to my channel. I'm going to introduce you to another software which is available on your Android, uh, on your Android laptop, uh, on your Android phones, and on your Android tablets and things like that, which is known as RF Analyzer. Uh, this app recently got updated a couple of days ago, probably a week ago, which is called RF Analyzer. This is version 2.0. Uh, this is a much improved version so you need rf analyzer which is available on play store and another set of software called rtl sdr driver which is right here as you can see it this one so two pieces of software this is the driver for your rtl sdr rf analyzer is the app that allows you to convert your mobile phone or your tablets to a rf spectrum analyzer i'm going to simply plug this in once i plug this in you will see this message if you have your rtl sdr driver properly installed you will get this message so let's hit ok once you hit ok the drivers are running at the background you can click on rf analyzer and you can simply go in and choose your signal sources of course it's still the same support as the previous version you have hack rf rtl sdr dongle these are the two software defined platforms it supports and hit play since I have my RTL as So I was just playing around with uh, this uh, FMD modulation. Uh, much better display. You can, uh, uh, like, you know, press it, move it up, move this up and down like this. So you can see this. Two types of sources of support you have AGC hardware agc which is automatic gain control or you can set the gain manually as well so you can set the gain manually and things like that so right now i'm tuning into rf uh, fm this is an fm station and also i saw a tuning knob as well so you can go to demodulation you can select the volume all the in the previous software actually everything was done through uh, there was an option here and you you do, you go and 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 play with the option using those things, but here it's just right in front of your page. So simply hit uh, demodulation on FM wide. Or better, lahu or ghost or jis jis Allah ki bhi aur jaaye aur jo janwar. Let me turn this demodulation off. So, so here you can easily visualize your demodulation. All right. Let's say you want to look at source. If you want to change the frequency, you can also change the frequency as well. You can do the recording of this. The recording, you can start recording this. Whatever the transmission that you're seeing, you can you can do a recording based on the size itself. You want to do like, for example, if you want to do it in a couple of seconds of recording minutes or in terms of data size and things like that, you can do that as well. Uh, you can go here, you can look at the display settings. You can uh, you can go here and you can play with the waterfall speed. Just you can you can play with the average frame size. You can play with FFT size as well. All right, you can play with FFT size as well. You can play with the frame size, or you can auto scale it. Auto scale is m m working much better as compared to previously. You can also play with this if you want to move this vertical axis as well, or you can just play it using this as well. Your scale of vertical axis, then a scale like this. So, so it's a very beautiful uh, upgrade. Uh, after 10 years actually i've been using this software for a while and this is a very good upgrade that that they have done and i'm i'm really happy about it and i think it has a trial of seven days and then you can uh, after that you can pay for it like for a couple of bucks you can you can you can get the entire thing so let me just stop this and also show you with this with my hack rf as well since it's a port hack hack rf as well so let me just simply plug in my hack RF for wider version. And let me just click OK and hack RF. OK. There we go. So this is my hack RF. I think I probably have to restart this. Uh, but you can just simply plug in your hack RF as well. Just remove this. Let me close the app again and plug this again. Now let me do it. 
and I'll show you that indeed. Okay. And change this frequency to 935. Apply. Here we go. So you can also see that that it is indeed working for Hack RF as well. So right now we are monitoring this. I can go here and I can go to my settings. I can improve this plot uh, display. Just be averaging auto. So this is without auto scale. This is auto scale. And you can see this, this is that we're monitoring at 935 megahertz. So this, this software that you're looking at is a much improved version and you can see the device name as well. So I just wanted to introduce uh, you to this uh, beautiful software that is available for free. You can download this and after seven days of trial, you can actually pay for it and you will get all the features. So I hope you like this small video. If you have any questions, leave it in the comment section. Don't forget, please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. And thanks for watching.